Today is fun. Today is something kind of new for us. We're in the Activision Capture Studio up here in Santa Monica. This is a facility where we can do motion capture and video and texture reference of actors. We're over on the facial capture stage. And and what we're doing is we brought in our actor Jordy. Um video chamado Faces of War. And we basically have him sitting inside a sphere of cameras. It looks more scary than o processo de como eles capturam as expressões faciais dos personagens. The cameras are all synchronized together and so Jordi's going through all these stages of different emotional states. What we need is that moment of of realization, the calm. By sort of striking different poses, we can basically capture a whole range of different types of muscle movements in the face, from the areas around the mouth to the eyebrows up down sorrow, joy, happiness, you name it. In the past, we've spent a lot of time trying to go for building a character from scratch. And that is an amazingly fun process. But you can take a long time finding your way. So creating a digital scan of an actor, that gives us something real to start with. And then recording our actor's performance gives our animators a very inspirational point of reference as they bring the character to life. Cut, hold that. Não só as expressões faciais, né, mas a própria face do ator acaba sendo a face do Andwin. Not only is he really good at the performance side of it, but he also looks enough like the character that we can kind of push things around. Olha só, olha só, olha só. Porque se você modela a face do do personagem diferente demais, né? Provavelmente as expressões não encaixam. Not only can you see the budding of a very good actor in Jordy, but you also get the sense that he's a genuine person. I think we could have cast somebody a little bit older, potentially with some more experience as an actor, but I don't think that would have rung as true as finding a young man. This is sort of his coming of age, where now he's in charge of this really big army, and he's faced with a choice. Am I going to follow in my dad's footsteps, or am I going to be my own kind of king? And so there's an uncertainty to the character that, you know, by the end of the movie, hopefully gives way to a purposefulness, you know? And we just really felt like Jordy had those qualities. And action? We're always going back to humans. We're going back to the references that we can find in the real world, whether it's an actual human behavior or simply a stone wall. Once we've done that, that's where the creative freedom starts. Well, it's all acting, you know? Animators are actors. They act through their characters, and it's kind of a slow motion process, but they do have to inhabit those roles. If we have to find our own way, there's a lot of trial and error. There doesn't seem to be any real good uh, substitute for somebody coming in and just bringing all of their instincts to bear, and in just a moment, you can capture something that feels completely natural. Right now, you're twisting, and this arm kind of goes away. Maybe this arm can be kind of like out, like like that. Yeah. Shooting reference for animation. Essas pintas na no rosto do ator provavelmente são as referências para. They would shoot on film, of course, but it really is the same process at its core. It's relying on the intuition of actors, of real human beings, to try to be in a moment and give you something that feels true, that feels natural. Yeah, I think it's great stuff, Jordy. And so we recorded on video and we put our helmet cam on and we get all our tracking dots and we run it off our phone and we get these amazing close-ups where we can see every little thing that the actor's face is doing. But it's still in the end the same thing that they were doing back in the day. What we're doing is just, you know, applying the latest tools uh, to that process. For the Alliance! And cut. Que legal, nice, man. great. Essa é a magia por trás dos jogos, né? E principalmente por trás das cinemáticas que a Blizzard faz tão bem.